Welcome to what we call the staff. What's that? Well, it started a long time ago when someone noticed that if there was a line and we put a note above the line like this, it was higher. Or if we put it under the line, it was lower. So above the line, the notes sounded higher and below they sounded lower. That's when someone gets an idea and figured out that you could be much more precise if you added more lines. And the staff was born. What's that? How many lines? Well, let's see. There are five to be exact, all stacked on top of each other, but not too close because you need room for the notes to fit in. Oh yes, the notes. The oval turned out to be the perfect image for the notes. You can add lines going up to the right or down to the left. So many useful combinations. But you know, I'll talk about that with you later, so I'd better keep on task. Now we've got five lines and yes, four spaces. Such an amazing little thing, our staff. But suppose we need to go higher. Suppose we need to go higher than the top line or lower than the lowest line. Well, if that's the case, we put a line through the note and they are now higher as we have added a line to our staff. In fact, these lines have a name. They're called ledger lines. Their purpose is to extend our staff, you know, add more possibilities to it. Just like the other lines of our staff, these ledger lines, you can place the note above the staff or even below. So that's it for the old staff. Talk to you later. See you next time.